Jelly Roll Morton. Muddy Waters. Becoming so much like Luke, it's frightening. Now, I have a new appreciation for the blues. <laughs> Thanks to me, right? <sighs> Look, I know you didn't come over here to check out my record collection. Whatever's going on between you and Elizabeth, if it's all the same to you, I'd rather be kept out of this the loop. This isn't about Elizabeth or the baby. And I'm not coming to you as a brother. I'm coming to you to ask your advice as a cop. I'm here, and I'm on time, so you don't have to worry about me. I have pulled myself together. Great. Glad to hear you're all bright-eyed and bushy-tailed. You're going to need it. This is the hit and run with Kiefer Bauer. Yeah, Mac filled me in. She was charged with leaving the scene of an accident and released on her own recognizance. Well, I can't imagine that uh, Kiefer's parents took that news very well. Uh, Bauer's lost a son. And uh, it came out that Kiefer was the one who assaulted Christina. So there's no doubt that he was guilty? No, none. And not surprisingly, his parents refused to believe it. See, they don't, they don't just want Alexis to pay. They want to rewrite history in the process. How could they possibly do that? Well, Christina accused Ethan first. Then she refused to testify and finally admitted that it was Kiefer who beat her. And the Bowers are both attorneys. Right, right. And they'll attack Christina's credibility. They'll say that... She only named Kiefer as her attacker to excuse Alexis for the hit and run. Yeah. And with the charges Alexis is facing, she's going to be busy fighting her own battles. And that's going to leave Christina vulnerable. Are you serious? You're a great nurse and they need you here. You know how hard things have been for me. I threw away my life with Bucky. I'm pregnant with a baby who I wish had a different father. Things are upside down. I was kind of looking forward to just getting back to the routine of my old job. I know I screwed up. This isn't about punishment. Well, it sure feels like that. You said... Stephen, please, I do not want to work you in a terminal ward. You are ready to work. I trust in you. Now it's your turn to trust me as your brother and your boss. The first patient is waiting for you. Mrs. Smith? Bermuda, right? Excuse me? It's a Shirley Smith original. That's me. I could have guessed that. I'm Elizabeth. You like it? It's very original. <laughs> Thank you. You're perfect. actually think about my place in the world like my apartment and then I thought about this spot in my hallway that's kind of dark and this lamp would absolutely be perfect. Um, would you like to help carry this back to my apartment? Are you sure? About you? Absolutely. Ah, about that, not so much. That color's all wrong for your porcelain skin. I hope you don't mind modeling for me. Oh, please. My, my kids play dress-up with me all the time. Girls? Boys. Two boys. Boys are wonderful. Yeah. You can still have a girl. I always loved making jewelry. We all have to have our creative outlets, don't we? <laughs> What's yours? I used to paint. I knew it. Sisters in the Arts. Mm -hmm. Maybe one day we'll exhibit together. I used to dream about showing my art. What happened? Family, work, other dreams. Life. Yeah. <laughs> For you, I think something more delicate. That's more of a statement piece. <laughs> like something you would wear? Oh, 
I always tended toward the conservative. Nothing too flashy or eccentric. But then when I got diagnosed, I decided to throw caution to the winds. Now I go all out. Bold colors, textures, proportions. The more exotic, the better. And you know what? What? I found out I have a flair for it. People love jewelry. I give away more pieces than I keep. So, I'm thinking of opening my own boutique. Oh. <laughs> Self-indulgence, sure, but... Hey, I'm dying. Sue me. about interior design, you would know that this lamp couldn't possibly look good in your house. You're probably right, but that's my mom's house, and I closed it down. I picked up the new lease on Patrick's old apartment. You know what? It's got a completely different vibe, and this lamp, it's gonna fit perfectly there. Okay, well, I saw it first. Oh, come on, Lucky. I, I was across the street before. I could have beaten you over here, but I, I didn't want to jaywalk, and oh. you're a cop. You should appreciate that. Nice try, but possession is nine-tenths of the law, so. Okay, well, I live with Lulu, and if you let me, I mean, us, have it. It'll be a constant reminder of what a great brother you are. You can have visitation rights. Poor choice of words. We will think of you every time we look at it. Oh, that's so sweet. But no, I saw it, and I like it, so I'm going to keep it. That's a little obvious, don't you think? What is? Well, it's a lamp. Casting light into darkness. Kind of like your post-Elizabeth life. You see this lamp as a metaphor for starting over. No, I see it as a lamp, and it's going to go in my apartment, not yours. Oh, I really... Do me a favor, just save the pop psychology for Crimson's readers. Did I hit a little too close to home? Maybe. And maybe my life's on the proverbial trash heap, but I'll find my way. And you know what? I know your heart's in the right place, so... So I get okay. to keep the lamp. Lucky, I feel bad for you. Really, I do. Especially because I feel like part of this is my fault. And how is that? Well, if you hadn't cheated on Elizabeth with me... Look, just maybe everything that has happened wouldn't have happened. Like, you guys would still be together, and you and Elizabeth would still be married. The baby she's expecting would be yours and not Nicholas's. Or maybe Elizabeth and I just weren't meant to be together. Okay, look, here's what we're gonna do. Why don't you help me drag this thing home, and if I can prove to you that there's a place for it, you have to give in and stop analyzing my personal life. And if it doesn't fit? You can have it. Do. Okay, let's go. When this round of chemo is done, I'm headed to Naples. What's in Naples? Italian men. <laughs> I'll be sitting at one of those outdoor cafes, sipping my vino and staring at all the beautiful people as they pass by. <laughs> you know what they say. No, what? See Naples and die. I've always wanted to go to Italy. What's stopping you? I had planned on going there for my honeymoon, but plans fell through. It's one thing about getting a terminal diagnosis. You sure plan differently. <laughs> Creeps you out, doesn't it? Am I dying? I'm sorry. Don't believe everything you read. I've got a lot more than three months of living to do. <laughs> How'd it go? You were right. It was just what I needed. Great. I have to say, I'm surprised. Uh, it's a place to hang my hat. There's real consistency. This space has feeling. I don't know, when Patrick lived here, it was when he just started to date Robin, and she was trying to control his life. He resisted. It extended into this apartment. I mean, every time I was here, they were fighting over the couch or where to put the furniture. It was an endless negotiation. Well, fortunately, I don't have that problem because I have total control over the decor. Whatever I say goes... Which is why this lamp has now found a home. No, no, no. Uh, 
Um, if you're going to insist on coolly taking this lamp from me, the least you could do is have the good sense to allow me to help you figure out where to put it. Left. 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 This is left. This is your left. Your left. Over th there. There? Yeah. What, here? Oh. No, we're on the side of the couch, I think. Probably. That just looks I don't, I don't think there's any place in this room we haven't tried. Okay? Oh, you can't rush feng shui. Oh, I can rush feng shui. Trust me. You know what? I think you're just trying to get me to hate this thing, so I'll let you take it home. Actually, I think it probably would look better over there above the pool table. Oh, over, over there? Come on, where? Is that getting a little heavy? Where? Right. What this Your left. You can't even play cool Perfect. If it's here. Right there. Perfect. I think it should stay. But just don't move it, okay? I like it. 